before I joined NYP, I was in a library, library club in St. Gabriel Secondary School. Uh, most of the time, I used to be in the library dealing with books uh, and computers. So basically, it was more of indoor activities rather than going out uh, you know, and do all those outdoor activities. Well, uh, when I first joined NYP, I was definitely not interested in violin. Uh, in fact, I was interested to join a guitar club and I went for guitar audition. But sadly, later I was rejected. Well, joining a running club in NYP was accidental. In 2012, I, I participated in a campus road run and surprisingly, I, I was you know, fighting for fourth posi third position uh, whereby the, the top three were all um, the NYP athletes. So that actually caught my co the, co uh, the coach of athletics, um, you know, his attention and, and he persuaded me to join NYP um, athletics team. And that was actually uh, what really, you know, the, the step towards uh, my existence in the NYP running team. Well, um, I represented NYP in the 1005 event in 2012. It was at Bishan Stadium. I was, um, um, you know, definitely a first event. So I was fighting um, against uh, all the experienced runners out there. And the runners like Hua Chin and So Ruyong, um, you know, in the team. And um, the funny thing about this, this competition was, uh, you know, I was really sprinting in the first lap already. I mean, giving my best in the first lap. Um, and I was with the leading pack with Ruyong and Hua Chin. And, well, um, I mean, race is not like that. Um, it's all about tactics and, and, and position and stuff. So later on, uh, I ended up being, you know, the second last uh, in the race. So that was my first experience of a run. Well, there are a lot of, lot of ways um, uh, of how running actually helped me in my personal life. Uh, the first word I, I would like to use is discipline. Um, yeah, uh, before I joined NYP, NYP Running Club, um, I didn't have any goals, any, any certain aim. So I was definitely not a disciplined person. I used to come to school, uh, do my school stuff and go home, sleep, play around, this kind of thing. Um, but once I joined NYP Athletics uh, Running Club, um, I began to have my goals. Uh, for example, um, I wanted to excel in, uh, in my uh, steeplechase event and 10 kilometer events. And I began to you know, train accordingly um, to achieve my goals. So I had to put a discipline you know, to achieve those goals. So as, as I train more with the team um, and I begin to you know, move forward towards my goal, that actually slowly built up a discipline in me. And, and I realized that it actually helped me to put that kind of discipline in my personal aspects of life. Um, for example, your daily, daily, uh, daily matters, um, like you know, sleeping in time, studying, uh, or rather doing your homeworks on time, submitting projects uh, punctually, this kind of thing. So it actually helped me to balance both. Um, besides that, I would like to add another point, which is focus. I mean, discipline is important, but if you don't have a focus, that will really affect um, you know, whatever you're doing. So focus, when I say focus, focus on your running. Discipline, okay, the thing, so I'll, I'll give you a difference uh, in, the, in the focus and discipline. Discipline is when you, you know, like, go for a run punctually. Focus is when you put your 100% in when you are training for what or what you are training for so when i give my 100% focus in my trainings i know i'm improving um, at my maximum uh, or the best i could so focus actually focus in my running focus on my studies focus on my personal matters actually help me to really you know organize my things get my things done at the maximum output that was actually a big learning point big benefit for me from running